my faith causes me to change. Man, if I didn't believe in God, I couldn't see me being where I'm at. First of all, I would have told a whole lot of people off. That would have been the first thing. Second thing, I wouldn't have dealt or had dealings with the people that I deal with now. One of my best friends is 78 years old, white guy. And he tickles me pink. <laughs> I love him to death. He's funny. He, I, he's a joy to be around because he has faith and I have faith. So we don't even see each other. We talk about what we gonna do in God. <laughs> but I would have been with someone that had their pants hanging. Oh, yeah, yeah. Y'all don't know about T-Dog. I don't want to bring T-Dog back. T-Dog was that person that didn't have the head. That y'all like to deal with people. But that's why T-Dog was in the situation T-Dog was. I can stand with my head high because I know that I believe in God and there is no way situation that I'm in now without God. That's what compels me. That's what gives me the weapon that I have. That's right. That's right. Your ammo is on the recall. Some of us have been sitting dormant. You need to dust your weapon off first. Come on. Before you start putting the new ammo in there. Because you're going to get some new ammo today. God going to give you a reason to let him shine in you. That's what all the get rid of the sin is for. So God can reflect himself through you. Smoking, drinking, do all that stuff, that's cool. But it don't reflect God. It backs. People can't see God. God wants every soul Come on. to see him. Every soul. And Christians, we say we are the house. Of God, we are the carriers of the Spirit. 